how to copy favorites from one Garmin Nuvi Drive or Drive Smart to another. You will need the Basecamp software in order to do this. If you don't have the software, go to garmin.com slash Basecamp. Scroll down. And you can download it. It says download for free, and it is free. You don't need to register or anything to get it. And once you have it installed, you will see something similar to this. Uh, the version I'm using is 4.7.4 current at the time I record this in May 2022. Okay, so now a couple of assumptions. I am assuming that you have Garmin Express already installed and with that the appropriate Garmin USB drivers, which Windows 10 and assuming 11 as well, that's still new, I haven't used Windows 11 yet, but Windows should automatically detect your Garmin Nuvi Driver Drive Smart. When I have the software loaded, oh, one more thing, do you need the download maps? Uh, this is the global map, which means when I zoom in real tight, it's not showing everything, because it's just the uh, basic global global map. Now if I go to, uh, I have the Garmin map installed and I have all this stuff, but do you need it? No, you don't. Let me just back that up a bit. So having just the standard global map is totally okay because what we're doing here is just copying one set of favorites from one Nuvi to another. Now I'm going to go ahead and plug in with USB a Nuvi right now and when it is detected by Windows it will also be detected by Basecamp and then I'll just show you what happens next should show up in just a moment there it goes okay so let me close this and go back to global map there we go now we got a bunch more stuff over here we have the regular library up here and then we have I'm using a Nuvi 2497 but you could use pretty much any Garmin Nuvi driver drive smart and I go to internal storage and okay there are the favorites I have saved now a point of note here for home locations if you copy a home location from one Nuvi Drive Drive Smart to another, it won't necessarily assign itself to the home button on the main menu. Not in the software, but on the uh, Garmin device itself. You may have to reassign that and probably will. Just letting you know. But as far as all the other favorites are concerned, you're okay. Okay, so in internal storage, we see our favorites here. Now in order to copy them we do need to create a list in Basecamp. Easy enough. I'm just going to click on unlisted data here and then file new list and just call it favorites. Then I go to internal storage of the Garmin device again. I'm going to click once and then do an edit and select all. I'll do that again because I went through that a little fast. Click any one of the favorites here. Edit. Select all. You see I'm all highlighted. Edit again. Copy. Click on the favorites list which is empty right now and then edit and paste. There we go. We now have our favorites copy. Now what I do is while I have the favorites list highlighted I click on home and then edit and you can do remove from favorites but I would do an edit delete because remember if I copy that over to another one it won't necessarily assign itself to the home button on the other Nuvi we copy it to. Right now Assume for the moment I unplugged the Nuvi and plugged in a different one, a different Garmin. To send it over to there, when you plug it in you'll see it listed under devices and such. What I do is I go to the favorites list here 
edit and select all and then I go to device send to device send favorites to device and then you can do the memory if there's a memory card inside the Nuvi or driver drive smart will be there you don't need to do that just go right to the name of the device and OK and it will send it within seconds it's very fast because these things hardly take up any space then they will be copied from one device to the other and that's it that's all you need to do so I'm going to do this once more just to show you the process so let me remove and delete unique content don't do this part don't do this part unless you really want to delete favorites so I'll get rid of that so again you plug in the Nuvi Drive or Drive Smart that has the favorite you want to copy. Click on internal storage just to confirm that they are there. Okay. Oh, one more little note. You may want to click on just this red flag here, which is just show waypoints. If you have all data, it may show the track data. You don't want to copy that over because you don't need it. You just need the favorites. So if you just want to see the favorites, just show waypoints. Right, let me recenter this screen. There we go. Right, so I have confirmed. All right, there are the favorites I want to copy. I go over to unlist the data file, new list favorites. Go back to internal storage, edit, select all, edit, copy, click on favorites, edit, paste. Unplug the Nuvi Driver Drive Smart. Put in the other one I want to copy the favorites to. We make sure we're on favorites. Edit. Select all. Device. Send to device. Send favorites to device. Oh, I forgot one part. <laughs> Before we do that, yeah, in favorites we don't need the home location. So edit and delete that. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Then plug in the new V driver drive smart you want to copy the favorites to edit select all device send to device send favorites to device click and OK and it will copy them over and that is how you do it now the nice part about all this is that once you're done is that you can manage favorites in here because when you close Basecamp it doesn't delete what you put in there it will come back which is nice. Now if you bounce between two or more GPS's this is especially helpful because you can just get all your stuff in here and then whenever you need a copy from one to the other you can totally do it. No this is not an online way of doing this. There is manual involvement. You have to bring the GPS inside. You do have to plug it into USB and you have to copy it over yourself but at least you can do it and there will never be a point, unlike online mapping systems where your favorites just magically disappear. Well, that never happens here. Your favorites were always there, and that's great.